Welcome to our channel. Today we'll take you on an incredible journey through the world of physics as we unravel the hidden depths of Aruba's mesmerizing dive vacations. Aruba, known for its crystal clear waters and breathtaking marine life, holds countless secrets waiting to be discovered. And with the help of physics, we can uncover these mysterious wonders like never before. First, let's talk about buoyancy. When you dive into Aruba's paradise, you become weightless, effortlessly floating amidst the vibrant coral reefs. Understanding the physics of buoyancy allows divers to control their depth and move gracefully underwater, like dancing with the currents. When divers descend into the ocean, the water's pressure increases with depth, causing their wetsuits, tanks, and other equipment to compress. As this happens, divers become more negatively buoyant, meaning they tend to sink. To counteract this tendency, divers use buoyancy-controlled devices or BCDs filled with air to regulate their buoyancy. By adjusting the amount of air in the BCD, divers can achieve neutral buoyancy, where they neither sink nor float but remain suspended at their current depth. Neutral buoyancy allows divers to effortlessly explore the underwater environment without disturbing the delicate marine life below. Moreover, mastering buoyancy control is essential for preserving the fragile coral reefs that abound in Aruba's waters. Proper buoyancy techniques help divers avoid accidental contact with the reefs, minimizing the risk of damage to this precious ecosystem. Now let's dive deeper into the world of pressure. As you descend, your body experiences increasing pressure due to the weight of the water above you. Understanding pressure is crucial for divers to plan safe and enjoyable exertions. The deeper one dives, the more the water's pressure affects the body and breathing apparatus. This phenomenon is why dive tables and dive computers are indispensable tools for divers. These devices help calculate safe dive times and decompression stops to prevent decompression sickness or the bands. In Aruba, divers are treated to an array of dive sites at various depths, each offering unique marine life and underwater landscapes. From shallow coral reefs teeming with colorful fish to deeper wrecks shrouded in mystery, Aruba's diverse underwater terrain caters to divers of all skill levels. Next, as divers delve deeper into the ocean, they also encounter changes in temperature. Aruba's warm tropical waters offer pleasant diving experiences. But as divers descend, they may experience a drop in temperature due to the thermodynamic properties of water. The decrease in temperature can pose challenges, especially for prolonged dives. To counteract the chill, divers wear wetsuits that trap a thin layer of water between the suit and their skin. This water is warmed by the body, providing insulation against the colder surrounding water. The thickness of the wetsuit varies depending on the water's temperature and the individual diver's cold tolerance. Beyond the physical aspects, thermodynamics play a fascinating role in other underwater phenomena as well. For instance, divers may encounter thermoclines, where layers of water with varying temperatures meet, causing a sudden change in water temperature. These thermoclines can create unique underwater experiences as divers pass through the distinct layers. We also have the concept of visibility and light. Aruba's dive vacations are renowned for their exceptional visibility. The clear waters offer divers the chance to see a vast array of marine life and stunning coral formations. However, visibility is influenced by various factors including water clarity, sunlight, and particulate matter suspended in the water. As sunlight penetrates the water, it is absorbed and scattered by the water molecules and suspended particles. The longer wavelengths, such as red and orange, are absorbed more quickly, leaving the shorter wavelengths, the blue and green, to dominate the underwater landscape. This phenomenon is why colors appear differently underwater, with reds and oranges often fading out at depth. Additionally, suspended particles like plankton or sediment can reduce visibility by scattering light. 
Despite these challenges, Aruba's waters often boast excellent visibility, offering divers the chance to witness the vibrant underwater world in all its glory. As divers venture deeper into the ocean, they may also encounter a phenomenon known as nitrogen narcosis, affectionately dubbed as the martini effect due to the perceived resemblance to alcohol intoxication. Nitrogen narcosis occurs as a result of the increased pressure experienced at depth, causing nitrogen to be absorbed in higher quantities in body tissues, including the brain. The exact mechanisms behind nitrogen narcosis are not fully understood, but it is believed that the increased nitrogen levels affect neurotransmitter activity in the brain. This leads to altered cognitive functions, including impaired judgment, slowed reaction times, and even a feeling of euphoria in some individuals. The severity of nitrogen narcosis can vary from person to person and is often compared to the effects of alcohol consumption. At depths beyond 30 meters or 100 feet, divers may experience mild symptoms, such as feeling of lightheadedness or giggling uncontrollably. However, at greater depths, the effect can become more pronounced and potentially dangerous. To manage nitrogen narcosis, divers must exercise caution when planning dives to deeper depths. Diving within the limits of their training and experience is essential to minimize the risk of experiencing severe narcosis. Some divers may undergo specialized trainings, such as deep diving courses, to develop skills and techniques to cope with the effects of nitrogen narcosis. Managing air consumption is also a critical skill for all divers, as it directly impacts dive duration and safety. The rate of air consumption can vary depending on factors such as depth, physical exertion, and water temperature. To optimize air consumption, divers are encouraged to adopt efficient breathing techniques such as slow and deep breaths. Staying calm and relaxed underwater can help reduce air consumption, ensuring that divers have sufficient air reserves for the entire dive. Gas management involves calculating and planning the amount of breathing gas required for a specific dive profile. Divers must consider the depth, duration, and decompression requirements to ensure they carry an adequate supply of breathing gas. Modern dive computers are invaluable tools for gas management as they monitor factors like depth and time, calculating the remaining bottom time, and indicating decompression stops if necessary. This data helps divers make informed decisions to ensure a safe and enjoyable dive. Proper gas management also includes adhering to no decompression limits or NDL to avoid the need for decompression stops during the ascent. Staying with an NDL allows divers to ascend directly to the surface without requiring additional decompression time. Aruba's dive vacation offer an extraordinary opportunity to unveil the hidden depths of the underwater world. By understanding these principles, divers can unlock the secrets of this mesmerizing realm. Whether exploring vibrant coral reefs, discovering intriguing shipwrecks, or encountering fascinating marine creatures, the beauty of Aruba's underwater world is bound to leave a lasting impression. What do you think about this topic? Share your thoughts in the comment section below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to Dive Explore channel. I'll see you in the next video.